so smooth. Hey, what time is it? What time did you get off today? 6.30. 6.30, that's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. And you know what showed up on our doorstep? Not a puppy. No. A new to me, Matthews Triax, new compound bow. It is a 2018 model, so I've never had a bow this new. I'm freaking out right now. I got a crazy good deal on it for what it was, and I'm gonna sell my bow my Matthew Z7. So if anyone wants to get into bow hunting, it's a great bow. It shot through my bear at 30 yards, complete pass through, and it shot, it's this one right here. Um, the only thing is I'm keeping this sight, I'm gonna switch the sights, but other than that, it's gonna come just like this. Brand new QAD uh, rest that's under warranty. They sent me a brand new one. It's gonna include the Axion stabilizer. It's 70 pounds, 60 to 70, 28 and a half inch draw. And here we go. I'm gonna do a couple shots at these targets with my older bow. And then I'm gonna shoot my new bow. So are you disappointed in your new one? Not at all. And I just put the old sight on it. Yeah. Just so I could shoot the bow to feel the difference. Okay, old bow. Do you notice a big difference in the sound? I can feel the difference. The draw is so smooth. I want to say, and I don't know if it's just a biased thought, but it sounded like there was less vibration in the triax. There is a lot less. All right, just shot uh, the Triax and the Z7. The bottoms were the Z7, good group. Tops were Triax, good group. <laughs> so they are both great bows. As you can tell, a little bit more penetration, so I'm pretty sure the Triax is shooting quite a bit faster than uh, the Z7, but um, I clocked the Z7 at Duclaw Archery through the chronograph, and it was 298, so that's about what you can expect. Uh, with what I'm shooting, but let's go check out the boat. All right, real quick review. Z7, she's treated me well. Uh, I've killed a lot of deer and a bear with this bow, and it has been sweet, but I decided to upgrade this year. Thank you, honey. And so now this baby is for sale. If uh, you know anyone wanting to get into it, it's a great bow. 70 pounds, 28 and a half inch draw. Um, comes with a Q80 drop away rest. It's gonna come with this, um, what side is that what brand? An Apex three pin sight. Um, I'm gonna have it come with at least six arrows for you. This stabilizer with all the dampeners. So it's a great setup, great bow, but I'm stoked for my new bow. So let's compare to the two. Z7, Triax, both 70 pound, um, both same draw length. And as you can tell, the Triax is a shorter axle to axle, it's 28 inches. So that is from here to here. So it looks like a kid's toy, but tell me what it, let me tell you what, it packs a punch behind this, so. Um, awesome size as far as for hunting you know it's it's a dinky little thing <laughs> but i like it so it's gonna be sweet having it um they weigh about the same they got about the same specs this just has the newer technology the uh cross centric cams as you can tell these cams are massive compared to so matthews is a solo cam so this is the cam just to roll up here but huh the z7 is a 2011 model this one um, this is a 2018 model, the Triax, so shorter overall bow, a little shorter brace height, but I 
I've only shot it a few times real close, but the groups are dead. So the groups with this too. But is it blooding? Is that what you said? So don't get me wrong, Matthew Z7, stellar bow. So both incredible bows. I haven't shot this one enough to tell you, give you give you a good review on it, but so far I love it. My wife shoots the Z7. We had the exact same bow, and she's gonna keep shooting it. So um, it's a great bow. They both are. You can't go wrong with Matthews. Um, catch us if you can. <laughs> Pretty much this bow, when I shoot it, it is dead in the hand. Uh, when I shoot the Z7, doesn't affect me that much, but after I shoot, you can feel a little torque in the bow. Um, they make stabilizer to offset that and stuff so that it just doesn't move. But with practically nothing on this, I shot it without the stabilizer at first. This is my wife's. So I just thought I'd throw on there. So anyway, uh, I shot it and it didn't feel like it torqued at all. It just felt dead. And I shot and it was... Did he just shoot? It was something like that. <laughs> Triax, baby. I'm excited. Uh, hopefully, we have less than a month before hunting season starts here in Oregon. So, I need to get this thing dialed in, shoot it a lot so I get comfortable, and hopefully, we'll smoke an elk and a deer and a bear. Why not? The trifecta, I'd take it. The trifecta with the triax.